Hi, Cormac here from the TrackX team. In this video, I'm going to show you some of the features of the track cutter, the window where you edit your files, how to highlight an area to edit, as well as making a precise edit and copying the edited clip into the mixing window to add to your video creation. To import media into the track cutter, drag it onto a tab or double click on it in the media browser. You can have multiple clips on tabs in the track cutter so you can work on many clips at the same time. Just click on the tabs to navigate between media. To highlight an area to edit, hold down the left button on your mouse and move it. A selection box will be created. Once a selection is made, only the area in the selection box will play. You can adjust the length of the selection by using the trim handles. If the clip contains audio and video, you can adjust the selection box so that it only covers the audio or the video. Once you are happy with your selection, right click on it and select Copy. Go to the area in the mixing screen where you want to place the selection and select Paste. To make a precise edit in the track cutter, Firstly, make a selection in the area that you want to edit. Then grab the play bar to position it over the frame you want the edit to start. You can use the scroll wheel on your mouse to zoom into the exact frame. Right click on the selection box and select Snap Start to Play Cursor. The selection box will now start at that exact frame. To end the selection at an exact frame, position the play cursor at that frame and select Snap End to Play Cursor. Right click on it and select copy and again in the mixing screen go to the area where you would like to place it and select paste. You have now made a precise edit using the track cutter. In the track cutter, if you wish to export this selection to a file format like mp4, click on the export button. Only the area within the selection box will be exported. You can also crop media in the track cutter using the cropping window. To learn more about the cropping window, please see the cropping tutorial. To speed up or slow down a clip in the track cutter, use the adjust play rate pot. If you wish to play a clip in reverse, click on the reverse play button. 